Okay guys, so this is a quick video, um, super last minute. I just got a signing. Um, I am a notary signing agent. I just wanted to make a video on this because it's just happening so fast. And um, like being a notary is like literally the best thing that I've ever decided to do and stuck with. So I'm gonna take you guys on a day in the life of a notary signing agent. And um, yeah, I got a signing at three, so I'm gonna show you guys everything that I'm doing. It's not 100% professional, but let's let's do it, okay? I just got off of work at 6 o'clock this morning, went to the gym, and now I got a signing, and that's my Friday um, so far, so let's go. Okay, so right now I'm just adding everything into what's called Notary Gadget. It pretty much keeps track of every signing that I do, and on top of that, if I, um, you know, have any mileage that I want to put in, if I have um, anything that I want to put in, pretty much I put it on Notary Gadget. So this signing is 90 bucks. So I'm gonna do the signing for one guy. And yeah, it is 37 minutes away. So I'm gonna literally account for my mileage. I'm gonna account for all that stuff on this website right here, Notary Gadget. It's an awesome freaking website. So when I do taxes at the end of the year, I will, you know, be able to, I won't be able, I won't have any issues pretty much. So yeah. Okay, so this signing has way too many rules. So they're pretty much telling me how to print this out. I gotta follow this. Um, they just have a bunch of rules. So that's one thing I don't like. I'm like, that's the, you guys ask me for a lot, but it's whatever. So let's just get it done. How they want it, they want me to do it this way. So I have to do it this way or not. If I don't do it, I won't get paid and I will be doing it wrong. So. Keep that in mind if you are a notary signing agent and you're new, or if you're just curious as to how this works. There's a lot of rules. So, yep. Goods. I go through this really fast, so just so you know. Keep this in mind. Legal size paper, you will go through it really, really fast. Okay, so I let my aunt borrow my desk, so my stuff are currently on the floor but this is only temporary the job still has to be done okay guys so i have about an hour before i have to leave and i'm just here sorting out the pages um i'm just going through each document and i'm just signing my notary part and then i can't stamp it ahead of time but i can sign it ahead of time so i'm using these stickies right here these stickies these sign here stickies so I know where to sign and I know where to tell the borrower to sign so yeah this should take no more than an hour hopefully okay this is hopefully an hour job for $90 I'm hopefully so it pretty much depends on me and yeah so here's the outfit that I'm wearing it's a basic t-shirt dress um, you don't have to be too fancy but you have to be professional so all right not wearing makeup right now on purpose because I have this paranoia that if I like touch my face or something, it's gonna go on the document. I'm gonna have to reprint it and it's, I have this whole paranoia. I'm glad that I look decent without makeup right now, like. So we're gonna do this document and then we're gonna drive there and we should be there before three o'clock. All right, so let me get this done real quick and then I'll see you guys later. Okay guys, so I just got done with my signing. It took about an hour and a half so the guy was so cool so cooperative he just literally he took the packet from me and he just started signing literally he was just like all right i got this he just started signing i was like whoa okay just do what you gotta do but i'm gonna have to go over it um when you're done he's like yeah not my first time whatever so he just went through it and we got it done in an hour and 30 minutes but we also were talking you're not supposed to do that but he was so cool like he was just telling me things and we were just chit chatting so that's why it took an hour 30 minutes but you're not supposed to talk so much okay so he was just interested in having a conversation and he was cool to talk to but yeah we're all done 90 bucks in th an hour and 30 minutes so now i gotta go to fedex so let's go oh my gosh that was the most stressful signing ever oh my gosh okay so it wasn't the signing that was stressful the signing went smooth but uh, it's labor day monday so if i didn't ship the documents by today it would ship out Tuesday, but he needs to ship out month. He needs to ship out immediately because 
his uh, mortgage starts on like Tuesday or something like that. So he needs it by tomorrow. And so I literally chased down the FedEx driver just to give him the, the package so that, you know, the FedEx driver could send it out tomorrow. And I was successful and I'm like, man, like, I'm an overachiever. I'm trying to like do my best and I am exhausted. Now I'm at Olive Garden treating myself. So yeah, tired, very tired. I literally just chased down a FedEx driver just to give him the package for the express. Can't believe I did that, but hopefully it paid off. So one thing I learned today, it doesn't matter how interesting your customer or client or whatever you wanna call them are, the conversation is so interesting. Just try to keep it to a minimum because I made a mistake today that I caught before I gave my documents to the FedEx driver. I missed a stamp for my notary, like I missed the notary stamp for the notarization. And I only realized it when I went over the document while I was waiting for the FedEx driver. So if I wasn't talking so much, we were talking about mountains and I was actually really interested in mountains, okay? Cause I went to the West coast and I seen a lot of mountains. Anyways. So yeah, we did a lot of talking and that's why the mistake happened. So try to keep them talking to a minimum, no matter what job you're doing. Cause that's one mistake I did today that I shouldn't have done. I shouldn't have like kept engaging in it, but I did. So here I am, but it's okay. I hope I didn't make any other mistakes. I caught that one. So that was good. So yeah, guys, that's all I got. And I'll see you guys in another video. Well, I'm going to end the video on this note because, um, I'm really tired. I don't know why. I didn't really sleep. Um, I, I'm literally just tired from work from last night. Then I went straight to the signing and now I'm here. So this is the day in the life of a signing agent. I didn't get to record everything, but just take my word for it. It was kind of hectic today, but it's not always like this. So this was a good one. Um, I'm gonna try to be more detailed, but yeah, this was definitely a good feel for me to get into. I'm glad I got into this. This is like a good thing. So I do not regret being a notary and I actually kind of like it. Like the money, I'm getting some money. I'm, I'm getting some, some change from this. Like I'm getting some pretty pennies. So yeah, that's it for this video. I'll see you guys in another video. Bye.